Hey y'all, I know it's been a little bit since uh, I put a video out, but you know, this has been one that has um, been on my mind uh, for probably about a month and a half, almost two months, probably since the last time I put a video out. Um, and I think it's about time I did it. So, um, first, uh, I have a special guest with me. This is Lily Marie. Say hi, Lily. Say hi to everybody. Her and Daddy just hanging out. So, well, I got a minute. You know, we we really get this idea of love and and what love is, and it's really becomes kind of warped. You know, uh, we get this idea of a worldly kind of love that says, you know, I love you if you love me, but if you don't love me, well, I'm not going to love you. At very best, you know, I'll love you from a distance. You, you ever say that or you ever hear somebody say that I'll love you from a distance? I mean, really, what is that? H how how do we love somebody from a distance? I mean, after all, it doesn't sound like love to me. And so... You know, it's the you know I'll scratch your back if you scratch my back kind of mentality. The the kind of um, you know if if you're good to me, I'm good to you, and we're raised that way, and we don't even realize how tough and how wrong that 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 kind of lifestyle is. And and so we read in First Corinthians chapter thirteen. You know, most of us know this. It's the love chapter. We read what love is, and uh, let, let me share just uh, a portion of that with you, starting. Um, in about verse 4, it says, Love is patient. Love is kind. It does not envy. It does not boast. It is not proud. It is not rude. It is not self-seeking. It is not easily angered. Um, it keeps no record of wrongs. Love does not delight in evil, but rejoices in the truth. Always protects. Always trusts. Always hopes. Always perseveres. We read that, and when we line that up with our kind of love. How how does that line up? How does does that appear in the perfect kind of love that we read here? Now, now we can go through this. We can say, well, love is patient. Well, okay, I, I can be patient. You know, no problem being patient. And love is kind. Well, you know, I, I'm a pretty kind guy. And love does not envy. I, I got what I need. I don't need to envy anybody else. And love does not boast. No, I wouldn't boast. Uh... But love is not proud. Me, proud, no way. And it is not rude. It is not self-seeking. It's not easily angry. But then we get to the hard one. And this is the real, the real measure of if you are loving someone. It keeps no record of wrongs. Let that sink in for a minute. It keeps no record of wrong. How does your love hold up to that? Do you keep no record of wrong? Or, or, or when someone wrongs you, and even if you think you can forgive them, you say, well, I'll forgive them, but I'll love them from a distance. Because you're remembering the wrong. Love remembers no wrong. And we can see this because imagine if Christ remembered our wrongs. Hmm. Yeah. Yeah, it, 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 it takes a good examination of of how we love someone to really know if we are loving them according to the gospel. And uh, if we're not loving them according to the gospel, well then we're really doing them a disservice. Because a lot of us, we can go around, and, and I've done it myself, we can go around and we can claim to be Christians, but Christ said, they'll know you are my disciples by your love. So how does your love measure up? Let me tell you, and it's not something that we create within ourselves. This is this is something that's given to us by the Holy Spirit. If we don't know Christ, we can't do this. We can't do it. But if we know Him, this will be evident in our lives. We'll be patient. We'll be kind. We won't envy. We won't be proud. We won't be rude. We won't be self-seeking. We won't be easily angered. And we'll keep no record of wrongs. At least to the best of our, you know, to the best ability that that we let Christ reign and rule in our life. So my 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 question to you is: How does the love that rests in you measure up to this? I hope that it does, and if it doesn't, I hope that you let it. Till next time, guys. I love you.